that woman will be okay. Her injuries are described as minor, but it's what didn't happen in this parking lot that has police on heightened alert. They say that the people causing these types of crimes, they're concerned they could cause harm, and they don't want to see that happen to innocent bystanders. I do always pay attention when I get out of the car, when I get in the car. Wallingford police are stepping up patrols in parking lots like this after a woman in her 40s was dragged by suspects in a stolen BMW in broad daylight Saturday afternoon, all because she tried to hold on to her purse. Two suspects tried to steal her purse from her grocery cart as she was loading some uh, groceries in the back of her car. But that was just the beginning. Surveillance video shows the silver X6 circling the lot. You can faintly see the altercation between two male suspects and a woman. They actually had a struggle at the passenger side door of the BMW. Uh, the BMW then took off and dragged the victim about, I'd say probably about 20 feet or so. They pushed the woman out of the car and she hid between other cars while that car circled the lot. It looks like they tried to um, attack the victim one more time. You can have my purse. If that's really the case, I, I can cancel all my credit cards rather than get hurt. The incident at the stop and shop off Route 5, just one of several purse snatchings across the region. Wallingford police are working with North Haven, where that BMW was initially reported stolen. And just last week, North Haven police arrested three New Haven boys ages 14 to 16, accused of snatching a teen's purse on the other end of Route 5 in this lot. And while reporting on these incidents Monday, Fox 61 learned of another purse snatching in Southington at the Walmart parking lot in which an elderly woman was knocked to the ground at 10 o'clock Monday morning. 80-year-old Marilyn tells me she feels like a target solely based on her age, and that's why she's operating with heightened awareness. These are hard times, and people are getting desperate, and they have to be mindful of their surroundings. And police urge people not to take these matters into their own hands. They say the best thing you can do is be a witness for police. Take down any license plate information you can. In Wallingford, Samaya Hernandez, Fox 61 News.